I'm almost afraid to ask, but how can we lose? Charming. Oh no, only 10 casting power. Well, that's unfortunate. All right. And I'm going to send them to all three different entrances. Not 100% sure what the game plan is going to be. Actually, I have a plan now, and it's we're going to go in through the weak side. Good. And that should get some attention as well. Which is more than okay with me. These guys are just bait to draw them out of the castle. I'm hoping at least the flyer will go for it. Okay. And the ever useful longbowman. Kind of surprised there's not more upgrades to archers. Maybe with a certain faction or combination of abilities there would be. Bang. Yep. Actually, that person's in huge trouble. I think that person also might be get daved. Yep. 20 hit points, that's plenty. Okay, and it won't affect the units I don't want it to affect, so that's perfect.
Alright, this should be perfect. And we'll just keep doing that from the other side. Crusaders aren't affected. Good, good, good. Slight oversight, that's okay. <laughs> and it would almost be ideal if they died, but uh, I'm okay with them not. Can sneak the exalted through and hopefully hammer on the door from the other side. Uh, there we go. if we can get the kill in. 12 minimum damage. There we go. Uh, okay. do this to give them at least one aspect of improvement to their defense, I guess, and they won't be affected by the Shrine of Smiting, so we're just going to bottleneck and that's it. Hope they don't all die. Not quite. Human Priest, I think, is also devout. Yep. So they're immune. I probably could have used them to boost the defense, but uh, whatever. Good old Raspic. What will we do with you? I think we'll try getting him to smash down the front gate. No. <laughs> we'll send the Crusaders and they're more dispensable. Don't tell them I said that. not expecting that. Was expecting that. It's kind of interesting they chose not to move their units in closer. Matters is that that one didn't die. Okay. Can only be used once per battle. I forgot that detail. Well, let's duke it out, shall we? The most bizarre combat of the game.
14 minimum. I think we'll just prop ourselves. Whoa. Prop ourselves up there. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much what I wanted you guys to do. Thanks. We will just go back to the original plan. It's not much, but it adds up. can we do over here? Shrine of Smiting has already acted. Fifteen in defense sounds pretty good. And we can get the additional healing from the Storm Sisters. Get him into range, I suppose. Not quite. That is uh, a little irksome. Can we get one attack all the way through the walls? But not quite enough. Five to seven, perfect. This is a terrible waste of efficiency on this, but I'll take it. You guys can chill out there for now. It's just starting to hurt more now that we're getting close. Kind of wish I'd remembered that unit as well. Okay, the good news is I think my Exalteds are stronger than their whatevers. Okay, we can only do a maximum of 20 damage. I'm going to have to get up there with it. There we go. Now that we can actually see them. Probably could have done something much smarter in that situation, but uh, we'll live with it. Alright, 
Dwarf Evangelist, Healing the Elven Storm Sister. Pretty, I sound pretty cool describing all of these things, that's for sure. Okay. No chance of a kill on that one, which is kind of disappointing. I guess I'll soften them up as much as I can, though. Might as well go at it. And oh good, a shot in the back. Gotta say, as a unit, I'm kind of underwhelmed with the Evangelist. Uh, maybe if I faced off against more undead units, that would be... Like, I don't know, less of an issue. Alright. Pretty unimpressive final turn. Very impressive. <laughs> all right, one battle down, and I'll see you all in the next video. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play Age of Wonders 3 with me, Get Daved. So, in the last one, we pushed them out of their own city. Okay, looks like we still have to fight them. I'm gonna auto this one. What? Oh no, that's all of them. Okay. And victory. That's, uh... Well, the last episode was very long. That's what's important. Those islands that were never explored. And I thought this... Looks like there was something down there, too. Overall score. I guess this suggests that... Well, I don't know what that means. I find it interesting that my score was, like, behind everyone so much, because I was beating Gustav to death in this area. Maybe it's based on research or something. Who knows? Well, knowledge wasn't great. Everyone was happiest in, happiest in my territory. The military. I'm sorry for simming the end battle, everybody. I thought there might be one more. <laughs> I feel kind of bad. Uh, domain score. So yeah, I feel like this is the most important one. Military too, but as you can see, I generally got by with a small, I won't say elite force, because sometimes they weren't. Well, <laughs> this absurdly short video is the conclusion to uh, Age of Wonders 3. I uh, thoroughly enjoyed the game. 
uh, I had no knowledge of this series or anything, uh, as I mentioned in the first video, until very recently. Um, it reminds me a little bit of Elemental, as I've also mentioned. So if you're a fan of that, check it out. Or if you're a fan of this, check out Elemental. Um, Elemental Legendary Heroes is what you should search for on Steam or what have you. Uh, this one seems like it'd be really great for multiplayer too. So uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video.